Malaysia is taking the fight to the Islamic State terror network with a specially formed tripartite force. Codename the National Special Operations Force or NSOF under the National Security Council, the new unit consists of specialised personnel from the police, armed forces and the Malaysian Maritime Enforcement Agency or MMEA. Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Raza launched the unit on Thursday and said NSOF would be in the forefront in the fight against terrorism. Penubuhan NSOF ini mencerminkan komitmen kerajaan, manifestasi ketegasan kerajaan dan sikap kerajaan yang tidak mau kompromi dalam soal keamanan dan keselamatan. Malah kita tidak akan bersikap apologetik dalam langkah-langkah tegas lagi berkesan yang perlu diambil oleh kerajaan dan pasuk keselamatan tetap duduk kepada perlembagaan dan undang-undang negara. Based on the National Blue Ocean Strategy principle of sharing assets and capabilities, the unit will be under one chain of command. Najib said this would enable the unit to be deployed at any moment's notice. Tindakan mereka adalah sebagai satu pasukan yang integrated dan satu force yang insya Allah dapat meningkatkan kemampuan kita untuk menghadapi apa jua keadaan. Saya yakin ini akan menyumbang kepada usaha kita untuk menjamin Malaysia dan rakyatnya sentiasa lebih terselamat lagi, insya Allah. So far, 250 militants have been detained, 32 have died, while more than 60 are still fighting in Syria for the IS. Tidak ada satu hari pun berlalu tanpa lakunya insiden keganasan di satu tempat di dunia ini namun saya perlu betul setengah bahawa ancaman keganasan boleh kita sebut sebagai clear and present danger pada kita the Prime Minister also announced that in the initial stage, the force will consist of 17 officers and 170 personnel who have already trained for six months. In the past, questions often arises whenever a security incident occurred, which security agency should be sent first. Najib said there is no doubt now that NSOF would be the first responder.